is there's a transmitter that hooks up inside your house that links to this collar. And when you get a certain amount of distance away from the transmitter, the collar will shock you. And you can adjust how far the range goes by pushing plus or minus on the receiver. You can adjust it quite a bit with a max range up to 500 feet. And here's a chart that tells you what each power level equals. It actually includes a small LED tool to test it with, but today I'm just going to test it on myself. Okay, collar is on. As soon as I get about uh, roughly 21 feet away from the transmitter, I should start hearing a beep followed by a shock. I don't know how tense this is. I might just fall over, I don't know. Um, kind of feel like the running man right now. That uh, old movie with Arnold Schwarzenegger where they have the collars on their neck. If they get too far from the, their base, their head blows up. So my head blown up though, I'm just gonna get electrocuted. So uh, I'm gonna see what happens here. I, I don't know how intense this is gonna be. So I'm supposed to get the warning beat first, followed by the shock. I want to get about 21 feet away here. Ugh. Okay, I'm back. I heard the beep. I didn't get shocked. Shit. <laughs> so, oh shit. I haven't got shocked yet. All I've heard is a beep. But now I'm going to go ahead and go a little... <laughs> okay, I just got shocked. That was pretty intense. Whew. All right, so I just got shocked once. I didn't quite make it back in the safe zone, and uh, it felt pretty intense. So now I'm going to go ahead and go forward and uh, let it beep, and then continue to let it beep until it shocks me, and uh, see if I can ugh, see how intense this is going to be. So I'm anticipating the beeping sound. Oh shit, here it comes. <laughs> okay, I'm back in the safe zone. All right, works pretty good. <laughs> All right, I definitely wouldn't recommend you try this at home. Uh, definitely worked on me. I got my ass right back to the transmitter. It might be worse for me since I have it directly on the skin. The dog has some hair so it probably won't be quite as bad, but uh, I definitely felt it. It's uh, definitely not a toy. Thanks for watching. This is CLSL1. If you want to hear more from me, please like and subscribe. Hey guys, if you want to check out any more of my videos, just click any of these links.